Hey kids! Welcome to the video. Welcome back to Dream Daddy, I should say. Me and Ben, we're going to build ourselves another daddy from the ground up. So we're just pausing the storyline briefly. Because uh, we, we both regret it a little bit. Because uh, last time, of course, you know, we, we did clothing last. And we discovered that <laughs> there was this. And both of us have a love-hate relationship with wrestling. So we thought, let's make ourselves a wrestling dad. So, we are on the bod. So, do we have athletic bod, tank bod, <laughs> 205 live bod, 205 live uh, bod with, you know, a guy who's trying to be more than 205 live, Mark Henry. Or whoever this dude is, good lord, he's that. What is that? that? Just James Ellsworth. Yeah, James James Ellsworth, maybe, or you know, like an English teacher who's decided to become a wrestler recently. You know, <laughs> Spike Dudley. Yeah, exactly. I'm I'm done with my life. I'm you know. <laughs> um, I mean, so I think that I think this he's got to be got to be jacked. Yep. Yeah. Now, they they pretty much just like nair everything from like the neck down, right? So we're now for sure they they didn't used to do it for everybody, but now it seems like th there's like literally one hairy person, and it's Rusev, and hmm. they still make him, you know, shape his chest hair, <laughs> and no one else because they have the one hairy person. Exactly, they've, they've got that covered. Yeah. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Let's let's remember and to go see the rest of them. Triangle head. Look triangle. You're gonna you're gonna feel real dumb when you go right back to that. Square first head, one. round head, oval head, heart head. Eh, never mind. I, I, there's a Bret Hart joke in there somewhere, but I don't <laughs> diamond head. Diamond head. That's, that's a. Isn't that like a Marvel villainous character, Diamond Head? I don't know. It sounds name wise, it sounds more like a DC villain. <laughs> he has he, somebody like he fell into a vat of diamonds and they're all impaled in his head, and now he's impervious to I don't know laser beams or something or glass. There you go, impervious to glass. So five o'clock shadow? Yes? No? Yes? Uh, well, if he, if we're gonna give him facial hair, I don't think he'll need the shadow. Yeah, that's that's true. That's and true. he'll and he'll almost certainly have facial hair. All right. Here we go. <laughs> that's so, kind of that's kind of awesome. Even though he has a huge forehead. He has a huge forehead. That's because he's got the chin butt. So that's yeah. Um, yeah. The the huge forehead may not be escapable. R okay, right there he looks like. <laughs> He looks like uh, Jerry Lynn. <laughs> That's very true. Just every once um, in a while, he needs to go ooh and do the "I love you" sign with his hands. But uh, but yeah, I, plus I don't think Jerry Lynn ever wore a cape because he 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 fought he fought very hard to show no personality <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. over the course of his career. Excellent wrestler in the ring. Excellent. He 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 never made it big because he had only wrestling skill i'm afraid he has the he has the in ring uh charisma of jai courtney on the screen if that <laughs> if anybody knows who jai courtney is um the, uh yes what was i gonna say oh i was gonna say he may have actually had a cape at one point when he was mr jl in wcw wow it's it's entirely possible just because he came out and they tried to pass him off as a luchador so <laughs> hmm a Randy Orton haircut. <laughs> it looks like Neil Patrick Harris. <laughs> We're going with it. Neil Patrick Harris, the wrestler. Exactly. The wrestling years. Before he was a big comedy star and on Broadway and writing his own books, he was a wrestler. Um, exactly. And the cornrows, that was Justin Timberlake circa, you know, 2001 or whatever. <laughs> no. <laughs> This we're making a Patrick Stewart wrestler. No, <laughs> I think this is also a no unless you have something really good in mind for no. his high and tight. I do not no to this because I'd say that he has not gone to Hampshire College. 
and we're already using us on our original character, so we need to move on. Once again, this just looks like, you know, someone who's like 45 and like, I'm getting into wrestling. No, <laughs> no, you shouldn't do that. Um, the pompadour hair. That's very superhero y. Mm. It's very Helen Hunt. <laughs> <laughs> Mad about you. All right, that's that's it. That's it for hair. Um, I don't, yeah, I don't know, fine man. Wrestler, no, no, nothing, nothing super like spoke to me. Like obviously, like the, the, these first two kind of have that like very much kind of like 80s, 70s, 80s, you mm -hmm. know, wrestlers from Texas type of feel and stuff. <laughs> yes. You know, like, like you know, who were always in groups of three or four, and they were all brothers. Even if they really weren't, they were all brothers. You know, exactly. He, uh, I think that if you did the second haircut, like the straight, slightly like shoulder length hair, mm. one that your mouse is on now, I think if you did that and you colored it dark, it would look uh, like AJ Styles a bit. So <laughs> that, that could potentially work. All right, we'll stick with that. <laughs> I'm a wrestler. Yeah. <sighs> I've been I wrestling. Hate wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jerry Lynn. <laughs> I kick. I kill myself for nothing. My um, special move is called the Ram Jam. You know, it's, <laughs> he looks like he's just been beaten down. <laughs> I'm gonna this... die in the ring. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I think there should be track marks in this guy's arms. Yes. Uh, <laughs> ah! And white dust under that guy's nose. <laughs> <laughs> let's get in the ring, let's get in the ring, let's go, let's do it, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, half the radies, uh, 80s wrestlers ever. Um, <laughs> just doesn't work. Uh, hi there. I'm, <laughs> I'm wrestler. <laughs> I'm Japanese wrestler with bleached hair. <laughs> 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 I'm the heel wrestler who doesn't know how to be a heel properly. Yeah, exactly. I just wring my hands a lot and laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure what that is. Shiny eyes. Shiny huh? eyes. Huh. Oh, we didn't color uh, change the color of his hair, BT dubs. Oh, you're right. I don't Back know. You, yeah. I'm not sure. I mean, I don't know what it should be, but... Well, AJ Styles has some sort of brownish hair dark brownish right. hair mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah it's like with that nah too reddish mm, too dark too boring too mother goose too no i don't um, <laughs> I, th I, I don't think, know what that means <laughs> <laughs> um i think that works sure yeah <laughs> why what? is the streak still brown like whatever that shiny part is is like just looks like a smear of like something. That was uh, that was uh, the hair Ric Flair was trying for in the eighties. Um, <laughs> exactly. Bleach it more. <laughs> exactly. All right. Yes. So back to the eyes. So we were here. Ah. Hmm. <laughs> Jesus. So if it, it's kind of it, terrifying, yeah. It, it, depending on the gimmick, I guess snake eyes could certainly work. Arr, no, oh god, space no. warrior eyes. What does that mean? It means um, he looks like Invader Zim. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm like I, I don't, I don't get it. But I love the Tintin eyes. I will never not love the Tintin eyes. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it, for, for whatever reason, the Tintin eyes are just like shorthand for like, you know, this person is pleasant, you know, type of thing, yeah. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Upturned eyes, or... <laughs> <laughs> also on cocaine eyes. Yes, I realize, and once we gave that to our first guy, so, you know, if we want to go with, I think maybe, you know, <laughs> it's just so ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing to me. Is also if you put it on the, the 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 top cocaine eyes and you look at the bottom left screen, <laughs> just, it's, it's, the close up is even more amazing. Hey, how's it going? Oh, good. So who's going over tonight? Ah, you're uh, you're putting over the Brooklyn Baller. 
<laughs> to make that noise from uh, from Metal Gear Solid, like a brrrr. What was that noise? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, like that, that noise looks broken. If we were kind of going an old school restaurant, I might, I might, I might go with that. Hmm. Rumpole nose. That's just snub nose. I, 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 I don't know. Wide nose. Sure, sure, I guess. Yeah, I don't know, man. Um, yeah, I mean, really, any of them can yeah. fit. They all, they actually do, do a fair amount of. Uh, they make the face look pretty different. But uh, I'm gonna go with the uh, Roman the, nose. Yeah, yeah, that kind of broken hawk nose. All right, and not hawk from the duo there. <laughs> You know, Tony Hawk, Le- and it's not. <laughs> Tony Hawk is the Legion of Doom. <laughs> All right. Hi there. <laughs> I didn't think so. <laughs> mm, I guess I'm okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's hit me now, man. Oh, yeah. The Madonna mouth? Is that Madonna yeah, just because of the gap. I was thinking. Oh, that. Okay. Hamburger mouth. I, I just. Yeah, I got. Does anyone yeah. Yeah. purse their lips like that? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> imagine He's officially if, a psychopath. Imagine if you saw that sending across a ring from you. You'd, <laughs> you'd lay down for that three counts, you know. <laughs> Finger poke of Doom 2 coming up. We're not fucking. <laughs> oh, my God. In fact, I'm not even laying down for the three. It's going to be a count. Where's it going? Nine, yeah. ten. That wasn't the finish of the match. Fuck off. I'm out. Aye. Poor guy's a heel. That's a pretty good mouth. <laughs> this one, too, I think. Oh, this one. Even though, uh, but we chose it on the last one. We did. We did. Damn. I kind of like that. The smirk. Smirk? Okay. Yeah. I mean, that's got the the scar. Yeah, it's the got the, got the scar. From, yeah, scar from blading. Come on, man. Getting, um, getting it busted open the hard way. <laughs> 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 oh, those eyes are fucking hysterical. Yeah, yeah. It's, I, I, th- I think they kind of drowned out everything uh, else. We probably should have done the eyes last. Uh, look how different that looks with those. It suddenly didn't look like he's... I mean, he still looks a little crazy, but now he looks, like, hopeful. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, you know, the, the the building in front of him is burning. It hasn't started burning yet, but it will. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ah, burning. Oh, get the gasoline. <laughs> yeah, ah, uh, I burning. started it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, the fire is so beautiful. Oh, the, yes. one bef- the one before. You did what with your allowance? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you bought a John Cena shirt? You're out. Of, you're out of the family. You know. <laughs> That's not wild. Wild brow. brows. No, these are the wild brows. I don't, <laughs> these are just someone who needs to run their hand, finger across their eyebrows. This. <laughs> they make his forehead slightly smaller. Uh, I I say we go for the one with the scar. He's gonna be a, a wrestler. Yep. D- Danny brows. Boop. <laughs> Incredible. (laughs) (laughs) Or the Van Dyke. Mm. Mm. I am I am a highfalutin wrestling heel. (laughs) I I I I won't just I won't just beat you on my own. I will have my 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 compatriots here. See them crush the hero, thank you very much. (laughs) He looks so friendly, sorta. <laughs> yeah, it's weird how much it. <laughs> it's how much it covers up the smirk and how he looks. Very, there, he looks like he belongs in the woods. <laughs> Whoa! Now he looks like Kenny Loggins. <laughs> I'm all right. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Somehow that increases the smirky smile, and he just mm. um, becomes even crazier. Of course, I suppose if we named a wrestler, we, we, we might be more informed about our artistic choices for... 
Oh my god. Well, I say it's either the like the handlebar one, the you know, like the first one that you chose, or mm. the one to just to the left of it, the the, the fancy hipster one, handlebar facial hair. Wait, that's a handlebar and the horseshoe. So yeah, either handlebar or horseshoe. Either one of those is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it's too good, man. It's just too. I, I just you know, it's. You and I know wrestling history well enough to know that how many how many guys in the seventies and eighties and early nineties were running around the fucking country like that and whatnot in their <laughs> fucking wrestling gear, sort of long hair, and you know their giant stash. You know, just, oh <laughs> my god! Don't think his eyes really work. If, yeah. it were, if it were like reflective, like you know, Bret, Bret Hart glasses, then we'd be. You know, mm -hmm. But where you can scroll macho madness across or something. <laughs> yeah, I think no glasses is the way to go. Peer sings. Oh my god, I can't imagine having a piercing there on your temple and wrestling. That's just oh, like any serious piercings for me. Guys obviously do it. They obviously do it. But any serious piercings for me for like a wrestler is just like. You imagine just you know going down and whacking your ear by accident and whatnot, uh, uh, you know, or, or just you know get, you know getting ropes pulled up over your ear and stuff like that and whatnot yeah. while, you're, while you're doing something. No thanks. So much pain. I do think you could make his hair lighter. You could make it like a bleachy blonde type thing and leave his mustache and brows that color, you know, because then it would be <laughs> very Hogan, you know, <laughs> like especially like Hollywood Hogan, so that it's you know. You know, yep. when, when he had yep. the yeah the facial hair nonsense. And <laughs> look at the dude, look at the big picture in the bottom left. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's pretty incredible. Pretty incredible. The non lipstick colors. I think the first one is the best. If he's yeah. if he's that pale. Yeah. Which yeah, also that's, that's the other thing we did not change is whether his his paleness. It's, oh yeah, there we go. Better? Oh, sorry. Um, I mean, you can do whatever. I'm just I mean, like, if you wanted to change the color, you you of the lips, it would make more sense if he was like, if you wanted a darker shade, he would have to be a yep. little bit darker. So now, we, oh, if we, only I, you could make him orange, like fake spray tan. That's actually almost kind of good, like a fake fake spray tan. <laughs> so yeah, it's yeah, I, I, I kind of feel like we we have to go like a little bit tan because obviously these these cats. Are tanning, but he could be. I mean, he does look a little bit closer to an indie wrestler, so he could be hairy if you wanted him to be. I mean, I think he looks more manly myself. <laughs> look at that body hair. That's someone who has lots of testosterone. <laughs> <laughs> now with all of these important, important choices made for our character. What is his name? Oh man, Doctor Snaggletooth, MD, or something. There's gonna be. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I get it. I'm with it. I just didn't know where it happened. Um, it happens here in our brains, in our mouths, exactly. and in the minds of our fans. <laughs> <laughs> um, what would his name be? We do have this Star of David thing on his tummy. Mm. And correct me if I'm wrong. I believe that's a that's a star of David shape. There's been lots of Jewish wrestlers, mm -hmm. I, I, although I don't think they ever have like promoted themselves as Jewish though over the years. Um, you know, like they haven't used it as a gimmick. It's not like you know you, you don't have some guy coming out with like you know coming out to klezmer music. Yeah, coming out to oh god, that would be incredible actually. Oh my god. Well, dude, if if they came out to like see somebody should have. Somebody should have um, used like System of a Down because I remember I worked at a job where we were listening to it, and it was around the time I think when Toxicity came out, and we were listening to it, and he he had no idea he was older and he just had no idea what we were um, what we were talking about, and he was like, "This sounds like metal klezmer music," and it really <laughs> does. If you listen to it, it really does. It's all this. It's the same, you know. It's that same family of music. I mean, if they're yeah. Armenian, you know, it's like... Mm, yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I'm, I'm sure they were influenced by it when they were making their music back in the day. Yeah. 
So um, I just thought that was amazing, and I was like, oh, and so yeah, he could <laughs> come out, come out to that. But there was one guy, uh, the closest I ever saw that came, that he came out and was kind of like, you know, um, kind of hinted at it was Barry Horowitz, and he was terrible. That's true. That's true. Um, yeah, yeah. But uh, not like not in a way like he didn't. Cut. Well, no. Sometimes he did have the Star of David on him. I think like on his on his tights or his jacket or something like that. Yeah. But then he also started doing the thing where he was just patting himself on the back and he had a big hand on his back and it was terrible. <laughs> um, and then of course there's Goldberg, but that was never that was never his thing. He was just no. a freaking monster. So. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. He looks kind of surferish, so he looks like you know he's like you know. Very Hogan esque, so you know he's straight out of Malibu or something silly mm. like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sting, we call him Sting. Oh wait, exactly. <laughs> Malibu Ken? No, uh... Malibu Ken. <laughs> <laughs> I think Malibu Matt. I think that's that's a good one. <laughs> Malibu Matt. Malibu Matt. Um, it's, it's, it's like <laughs> Malibu Matt. He, he's Barbie's fling, not, not the actual serious relationship <laughs> with, that she has with Ken. Well, and it's also it's that's you know that's like classic Vince, like attempting to you know play down to the idiots who watch his product. You know his words, not mine. Yes. Yeah. Um, and you know like just, you know, but he's got to have a gimmick. He's got to have some. So he's a Jewish guy from Malibu. You know <laughs> that old stereotype. All right, so uh, um, what would you say, Malibu Harry? Uh, Malibu, Malibu Harry is good. I said Malibu Matt, but Malibu Harry is good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, does, does Barbie have a last name? Is, he could be Malibu Harry, you know, whatever Barbie's last name is. Horowitz. Oh, no. Horowitz. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I quick Google. No, it's, it's ask Sylvia. Quick, it does does. Barbie have a last name. <laughs> um, it ooh. came up in Google. Nice, that's awesome. Roberts. Really? <laughs> yep. Malibu Which... Harry Roberts. <laughs> yeah, we have ourselves a fucking winner. I think <laughs> we have ourselves a fucking winner. <laughs> the yep. undefeated, undisputed. <laughs> Champion of the world, <laughs> Malibu, Harry Roberts. <laughs> and the roof comes off the place. That's, exactly. That's what we have here. Well, kids, I think we've went as far as we can with this silly, <laughs> silly thought. So uh, if you enjoyed that, uh, like, subscribe, uh, share our stuff on social media and all, all that good stuff. And... Um, have 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 an awesome day evening morning yeah yeah <laughs>